Good morning, Labour Party. Oh, hello, Ed. It's Monday. Yes, well, I sort of got that, Ed. But why do you feel the need to phone up and tell me? Oh, right. You do your thinking over the weekend so you can come up with something new to galvanise the voters on Monday. OK, so what have you got for us, Ed? Ideas for your comeback speech. I didn't know you'd been away, Ed. Oh, I see. So what did you come up with? Zero. Sorry, Ed. I thought you said you'd come up with a new idea. Oh, right. Zero economy under the Tories. But don't you think people might see it as a bit negative? I mean, your ratings in the polls have been falling like a stone since that conference speech, Ed. Last time I looked, they were 13%. Mentioning zero might make people think that that's where they're headed. OK, so run it by me, Ed. The poorest people in society work in zero-hour contracts, and the richest pay zero tax to they, Ed. Yes, but that's not really true, is it, Ed? Well, I mean, the top 1% of earners already pay 30% of all income tax, don't they, Ed? I wouldn't call that paying zero tax, would you? Well, yes, I know lots of voters think the rich are all avoiding tax, but these people would vote for us anyway, wouldn't they, Ed? OK, we'll see if we can do something with it. Have you got anything else for us? I mean, it'd be difficult to write a speech for you with just that. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Uh, are we back to the lump in your bottom here, Ed? I know we were all relieved to hear you didn't have cancer, Ed, but I can't see how people would think having a lump in your bottom that isn't cancer makes you stronger. Oh, sorry. I forgot you didn't have a lump in your bottom, did you, Ed? So what's this about, then? The media? I don't think they're trying to kill you, Ed. I mean, I know some members of the press might have been giving you a hard time, but I don't think they go that far. Oh, I see. It's an analogy. An analogy. Oh, never mind, Ed. Actually, we were wondering here if perhaps one way of dealing with the media might be for you to adopt a lower profile for a while. Perhaps till next June? Well, it was just an idea, Ed. Anyway, sure, we'll work on the speech. I reckon you've given us something to work with here, Ed. OK, you too. Love to Justine. Jesus, a couple of lousy lines. How are we going to come up with a speech to lift the ratings with that? Wouldn't have surprised me if the biopsy turned out to be neural tissue.